It's day seven. We're gonna go back to Inside Out. There's a scene toward the end of the movie where Bing Bong and Joy are working through one of their biggest challenges. They fell into this area of forgotten or um, lost memories. And I may be uh, missing that just a little bit, but they're in this er they're in this obstacle that they've got to get out of. And the only way that they're going to be able to get out of it is to get out of this huge cavern, this huge gap. As they work to get out of the huge cavern, the huge gap, they get on their radio flyer um, airplane roller coaster, this thing that they use to go on the many adventures that Riley and Bing Bong went on when Riley was younger. So Bing Bong works to help Joy, and what they realize is they've got to start laughing, they've got to have fun, and they've got to ride this rainbow roller coaster, so to speak, out of this, out of this cavern. At some point, Bing Bong realizes he needs to sacrifice himself, and sacrificing himself means that Riley won't remember him anymore. But it's worth the sacrifice because it's going to help Joy overcome this obstacle and get Riley back on track. What I want you to think about is, think about the people who you can help. Who can you sacrifice something for to help them overcome an obstacle that they're working on overcoming? These could be people that you mentor, these can be people that you coach, these can be members of your team. How can you help them overcome a challenge? And then I also wanted you to think about all the great people who've helped you overcome challenges in the past. Who have been your bing bong and who can you be a bing bong for? Thanks, really appreciate the feedback. Love hearing the comments about your favorite Pixar movies and the lessons you've taken away from those. Uh, please subscribe to the YouTube channel, comment on this on LinkedIn or Twitter. Thank you.